be a hair video on this hair this hair is the perfect black cherry ombre color for the fall winter season and I'm gonna tell you dolls about this color about this hair about this company all that tea so let's get into it So this hair is from Ali Annabelle. So the lashes that I am wearing are also from Ali Annabelle. These are like the mink lashes that come in a little clear thing. I put them on today so you guys will be able to see how they look. So this is the lashes. So yeah, the lashes are really cute and wispy. They're great for work. I wore them today to work. So I like them. They're really comfortable. And they're a good mink lash, not like those cheap lashes that a lot of companies put in the package. So thank you, Ellie Annabelle, because you gave me some lashes I actually used. So yeah, this is the bag. Package came FedEx Express, so it was super fast. Shipping, I have in, I believe, three 20 inches and an 18 inch closure i do not have a frontal this is a closure i didn't even put any powder on the part or really customize it all i did was pluck some of the hairs out of the front a little bit to get it to look a little bit more like a frontal and i laid some baby hairs down and yeah this wig fits very snug really good i really didn't even have to put any adhesive or like glue or gel or anything on it but i did put a little bit of hairspray because I was going to work and I didn't want to be looking crazy if it started to slip back. But it definitely stays on really good. I just put a little bit of holding spray to hold it down. I didn't even put any gel or anything. I really love this color. The color is really pretty. And I feel like it's not too bright. Like it's still work appropriate. Because really I was like okay it's kind of bright. Like whenever you get into the sunlight the hair gets brighter like in here you probably can't really tell it looks kind of dark but in the sunlight or if you're under like a lot of light it can get pretty bright and i wore it to work today for the first time and my director is always like looking at my hair and you know asking me about my hair and stuff um because she's always like did you cut your hair did you color your hair whatever like she always thinks that it's my hair so she was like you colored your hair and i was like no it's a wig and like when i did my ponytail and stuff she's always like oh that's so creative i can never do stuff like that so yeah at first i was thinking like yo she coming over here to ask me about my hair and she about to tell me it's not work appropriate because we cannot have crazy colored hair you're only supposed to have natural colored hair um and this color is not really a natural color but i feel like it's not crazy like it's not a bright red we can only wear like blondes and you know more toned down regular type colors but i feel like this one is quite dark so you know it's somewhat natural but yeah she says she liked it so i guess i'm good so they have three bundles of hair so the hair is quite thin for my taste but the company wanted to do it with three bundles because they wanted something that looked you know more natural so i'm like okay cool i'll try it because this is not like my usual zhuzh with my hair like i usually like super full super long and also i could have sworn that i requested longer lengths like 26 and stuff like that but some kind of way i ended up with three 20 inches and i know i didn't request that because i never get the same length like whenever i'm making a wig um but I don't know if they messed up my order or if this is what they wanted me to review. But I did pick out this hair color. And I think the 20 inch is actually nice. If the hair was a full dark regular color it would definitely look a lot more natural. But with this color you know we know she rocking bundles. But it's a really pretty color. I can't stop playing in it. So yeah this is the hair that I had left over. I didn't use the full three bundles but this isn't very much so i feel like i didn't really need to try to squeeze it in because this is not gonna make much of a difference so this is all i had left this is not even half of a bundle the 20 inch bundles um were pretty long but 
the hair is still not super full. I feel like the hair has a nice thickness to it though. It's not like thin or anything. And once I actually do shampoo this hair, it will probably get a little bit more big and more volume. If you guys know what I mean, like when you wash your hair, it tends to get a little bit bigger. I did not wash this hair before I made the wig and sewed it and started wearing it. I was lazy, it was last minute. I needed to do my hair for work this week and I made the wig yesterday and literally here we are today doing this video. So yeah, this hair is super soft. I just wanted to come and show you guys the hair and stuff, not to pressure you into buying it because it's your own choice if you wanna buy it. But I definitely wanna try out some of their other colors because they have a lot of nice ombre colored hairs and they have the closures to match. And a lot of times whenever I have tried to get like colored bundles, they don't usually have a closure to match. They just have the bundles so you end up having to do a leave out or you know color your own frontal or closure. But that, I believe they had like a blue, a purple, like a greenish color, like some different colors and they had the closures to match. And I don't mind having a closure because a closure is easy, like easy to apply. And you know, less time, you don't have to pluck so much, all that, and it can just go on really easy. You don't have to glue it down at all. So I don't know, I'll probably be trying out a few more closures because it's really easy and simple for me for work because I can literally just put it on. Yeah, I feel like this install is nice and flat. I will show you guys the back. I feel like this install got nice and flat. Actually, what I did this time, I usually do my hair in two braids. I had a question about that in one of my other videos, so I did want to cover it. I usually do my hair in two braids and I like to braid it while it's wet so I'll braid it kind of like cornrows but not really no tight cornrows because I have nails and I can't braid the best. Um, so yeah I usually do two cornrows but sometimes it's a little lumpy um, like more on the sides because my braids tend to be more to the sides than in the middle just with the way that I braid. So I had started putting um, just two pigtails in the back and braiding it at the ends with slicking it back. But this time what I actually did was I just put a part in the center of my head and brushed my hair down and brushed it all into a ponytail, a low ponytail. And then I braided it and I flipped my braid up and it's flat under there. And it works like, and I got to moisturize my hair real good. So this is gonna be my go-to with wigs because I never really do like a full ponytail. I'll do half up, half down with wigs. so. Yes, a way to moisturize my hair and have my install look nice and flat and it saves time because I'm not having to braid. Plus, I hate taking out braids, hate sitting there getting braids. Like whenever I'm ready to wash my hair, I'm ready to wash it. So that worked out great for me. And yeah, I don't know, I love this hair. I don't know what I can say about it. Um, it is like the first day of me wearing it, but I haven't been getting any shedding at all from this hair. And the hair did stay tangle free. Like to say that it's colored hair, it's not really tangled at all. I didn't brush my hair out at all today while I was at work and it stayed looking really nice. And also what else did I want to say about this hair? Sorry, y'all, I'm shaking, but um, this hair is really nice, easy to manage. Oh, the way that I curled this hair was I just used a wand curl and I did some really loose wand curls in it. The curls did drop to like a really loose wave. It is rainy here and it was very humid this morning. So that is a part of the reason why my curls dropped even more. But I did not put any holding spray at all. And I feel like the wave and the curl of this hair is really nice. Plus I didn't want it too tight because the hair is already shorter than my usual zhuzh. So yeah, I think it worked out very well. And then I just bumped this little front part with a flat iron to give me that little flip back wing thing. So yeah, that is this hair. And I don't know, I just love the color. I think it's a great dark cherry or black cherry color because that's what it reminds me of with the dark roots. And it's nice, it's nice for the fall. I did put it in kind of earlier than I wanted to. I did want to wait and put this hair in once it actually got cold, but I was just ready. I couldn't take it anymore. I've been looking at this hair for weeks and it was time. So yeah, if you guys have questions, leave them down below. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye, dolls.
y'all because this is literally like you know now let me just tell you all on the gucci website these are full shape with the chevron pattern and this one is a full tip 